welcome to a new episode for Ask This Old House. I'm heading over to a homeowner's house who wants to paint her fireplace. Have any idea how many times I answer this question? Can you paint bricks? The answer is yes. As long as you understand the process, because once the paint goes on brick, it's done, it's forever, it's not reversible. Some people may say, don't paint brick. You're going to add color to it. You're going to get rid of that nice texture and that natural color from the brick. And some people may say, it's a trend. It comes and goes. But to me, the important thing is, as long as the homeowners understand the system and is that what she really wants, I go for it. After all, this is what I do every day, painting. Hi, Maro. Hi, Brenna. Nice to meet you. Welcome. Thanks for coming over. No problem. Look at this house. Nice. Thank you. But the email you sent it to me, it mentioned about your fireplace. Yeah. So my husband and I recently moved into this home. We love all the character that it has, but we're right. looking for ways to modernize it a little bit. So I thought we would start with the fireplace, replacing these doors. And I know it's controversial, but we also yes. want to paint the brick. All right. We can do that for you. Uh, it's a nice project to be done and uh, it's not expensive also. But once the paint, the brick is done, you can never go back to the original looks. We know and we're sure. All right, cool. Let's start by taking this door out. We have two screws at the bottom, one on each side, and uh, two at the top. So I'm gonna start to unscrew this one here. Now, we're gonna bring this out. There we go. All right, let's move to the side there. First, what we're going to do is clean this area really well. Now that the vacuum is done, it's good to have a wet rag and wipe the surface a little bit better. Well, now the bricks looks nice and clean. It's time to use a masking tape to tape around the bricks and the heart. Make sure we'll follow up this brick line, okay? All right. Yep. Yeah. Make sure you press down the edges really firm. Make it look easy. <laughs> <laughs> Let's protect the floor now. You don't need to be closed because we're going to put another tape on top of that. All right, let's do this. So what kind of paint are we using today? We're going to use a flat black high heat resistant paint. This paint is specific for this kind of area here, exposed to the heat. It can go from 1200 to 1400 degree heat resistant. And don't put a lot of pressure. This paint is thin enough. You might drip and run a little bit. because we want to make sure that we have a good coverage and also want to make sure that we cover the mortar mm. really well. And so I know we're painting the outside of the brick. What about the inside? I know a lot of people paint the firebox. I don't like to paint that because most of the time when you're going to use the fireplace, burning wood is fall and cold season winter. Oh, so when all of our windows and doors will be closed. All windows and doors are closed, and so once you start to burn the wood, some VOC might be lingering in here, and I don't want you guys to be exposed to that. Definitely don't want that. So why are we using brushes instead of rollers for the tile? Well, you notice that this paint is really thin. Yes. So by working with the brushes, a couple of things, we're going to have a better coverage and the paint is not going to drip so much and run if we use a roller.
Wow, look at this fireplace. It's amazing, and we're all ready to go for a fire. Well, it will be ready for you tomorrow. You know, one thing I like, we didn't paint the damper knob. And even has a little line of black right in the middle, kind of picked up the black from the surround. Mm -hmm. Looks great, the metal patina, I love it. <laughs> Send me a picture once you fire it up, I would love to see it. In the meantime, enjoy this fireplace. Absolutely. Thanks for having me here. Thank you so much for your help. You. Thanks for watching. This old house has got a video for just about every home improvement project, so be sure to check out the others. And if you like what you see, click on the subscribe button. Make sure that you get our newest videos right in your feed.